Hey guys, I am LB, and this video is coming up a bit late, because I procrastinated yesterday, and then I stayed up way too late recording the Duskers Weekly Challenge. And, uh, I shifted my state schedule. I stayed up to 2 a.m. Bad idea. I'm very tired. I might not be able to think properly. But let's check out Chocolate Pudding by Paper. This used to be Paper Player X, but apparently they've changed their name, and I now have to go through all my videos and change their name from Paper Player X to Paper. Stu, what are you doing? Making a test chamber? It's 4 o'clock in the morning, why on earth are you making a test chamber? Because I've lost control of my life. <laughs> uh, I didn't stay up to 4 a.m., but 2 a.m. is close enough. Alright, now with the video solution, don't watch unless you finish the puzzle or are stuck. Alright, let's see if my tired brain can solve anything right now. I'm not feeling good. <laughs> Shifting the sleep schedule is never fun. I've got a cube up there. Got a funnel, apparently. I don't have a way to fizzle this just yet, so I'll just leave that alone. Uh, oh, we can pull ourselves up, it would seem. Oh, and this gets us right up to the cube. Right, so we would want to use... what do we want to use the cube for? I assume to put on this button, right? This button responds this cube and... Oh, there's another cube, apparently? A companion cube. Well, that's good to be aware of. And there's nothing else up here but this. And that's just a way to get back, I would assume. And then we have this area over here. There's- this is the exit. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and put the cube on the button and see what all it does. It does the funnel, it does that flip panel, and it does something we can't see yet. Alright, let's find out. Maybe it turns the fizzer on, perhaps? don't need to worry about swapping the cubes, because they're tied to the same button, so I don't even know why they look different, because you respond them with the same button. Might as well make them look identical in that case. What's up here? Oh, this is interesting. Huh. that? That's like, glass or something? I suppose it must be glass. How do I go anywhere useful, though? Cause yeah, we have this funnel, but it doesn't really do us any good. And we can't go anywhere. Can't get over there. We can't do anything in this room, right? Yeah. I suppose we could do... that. Now it allows us to place a portal here. But it's covered in gradients, so we can't go there still. I suppose we could go over here. Oh, I should've brought the cube with me. That's what I should've done. Let's try this again, please. And somehow I accidentally oriented the companion cube in a non-favorable manner. There we go. Fixed it. Fixed it. Right. What is that button for? Because we need that to get out of here. Don't really have much of a choice in the matter of where to go right now. Oh, this turns off the sizzler. Okay. Why do I want that? Just so I can portal in here? I suppose. cubes auto-respawn, because I think I might want the regular cube here instead. Come on. Put this guy here. Since they auto-respawn, that would explain why they're different colors. Oh, oh, that was close. Now we've done that. There's not much we can do in here, really. Yeah. Not much to do but leave. Put this 
back on here. And then what? No, 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 no. Take this off of here. I guess it doesn't really matter too much, but... Yeah, because I could have swapped them this way anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, there's that much. So what do I- what do I want to do here, though? How do I get over there? How does anyone get over there? There's not- I didn't miss a portal surface. Oh, I did miss a portal surface, that didn't I? Alright, well let's try this again, then. Apparently I missed... that portal surface. Oh, you're kidding me. <laughs> Can't. Wow, this is cleverly designed. We do this. There we go. That's something new. Doesn't get me over there, though. In fact, it doesn't really get me anywhere I want to be. Because now this fizzler's on, uh... I think I trapped myself. Now I have to walk through this fizzler to do anything. Which isn't very useful, to be honest. Why did I do this again? Hmm. How do I get in there? And how do I get over there? I have to use that surface, but I have to be... Oh, how is that supposed to work? Because there's grading to block me from just getting up there normally. I can't put a cube on the button from a distance, because the funnel will only pull the cube away from the button. And there's some cheaty tricks I can do, but I'm pretty sure they wouldn't be intended. Right against the edge, so we're not gonna we're not gonna push a cube onto that button anytime soon. How do I get over there? How do I get in this room? I guess I need the light bridge to get over here, right? How do I get the light bridge? I have mentioned in the past that I'm bad with funnels, but... Yeah, sometimes I just can't see what to do, like right now. Come on now. Cooperate with me. There we go, so if we do that... And then what if we do this? This 
gets us a direct connection. But I don't really see how this is useful. useful, though. Be like, we could push the cube off the button, but that's about it. I don't see a reason to take a cube off of this button here. Like, once I have a cube on this button, I don't... There, there's- that's all the buttons I have access to right now. I can't access that button, and I can't access that button yet. So I just need to leave this here. This is the one that's tricky, because this toggles everything. here, which means we need a portal there, and there. But... There's not much we can do in that regard. Like, we can do that much. <laughs> that doesn't help. I guess we can also do this. Yeah. So we can do it, but now we can't get to the is the funnel. It's too far away to jump. We can't jump to there. And if I move myself over there... If I push myself over there, then I won't be able to aim at the portal surface anymore. Yeah, now I can't do anything. Quite stumped. I don't have any reason to go up there, right? Yeah, I don't have any reason to go up here, really. Oh, I can just see that from here. sure what to do, to be honest. Now that's off, but I can't do anything with that, really. I can't, like, pull myself over there.
Yeah, maybe my brain's just too tired for this right now. I don't know. Can't do anything from this side, right? Yeah, not really. Button's down there anyway. I need a way to have the cube on the button, off the button, and then on the button again, but that's just not possible. I think I'm gonna cut here, and I will be right back when I've figured something out, because this is going nowhere. Alright, I stared at it a few minutes, and I think I figured it out, so we can loop the cube back around. Which is something I had not considered. So, let's go ahead and try that, shall we? So, first of all, we need to get it on the button. There we go, that works. That was the practice. And once we stand up here... We, we pass through the fizzler. The cube loops around. And... Yes! Yes! Did it. Clever! Very clever! That took me a while to think about. And, now we'll want a cube here. Because of course we will. Right, I can see this, right? Yeah, I can. Save. And... Hmm. Might have made a mistake just now. I might have made a mistake. <laughs> let's try this again, and let's keep a portal out here, shall we? Yeah, let's- let's try this again. So I think- I think I should have kept the portal in here, re really. Do we even need the cube there right now? I don't think so, actually. Let's get that cube out of there. Right, I can just see it from here. Let's just put it here for now. Oop, come on, come on! There we go. There we go. And then we will place our black portal over here. There we go. This should theoretically work. Oh, come on, don't you be bouncing on me, cube. There we go. Right now, the question is... Can we raise ourselves up high enough? I think we can. Come on, game. Don't, don't play tricks with me now. I know this works. Alright, we need to take this cube off. Maybe we can even take it with us, who knows. Maybe we need to. Excuse me, game! That's solid, huh? Well, fine, I guess it is solid, but... it really shouldn't be. I guess in real life, it would be solid, but... <laughs> the frame of the grating... I didn't even consider that. Oh, and I dropped the cube already. Because of course I did. There we go. Did it. Right, so now I push the cube over here, stand on top of it, and... Gotcha. Now we can put this here. Yes. Now we have made some semblance of progress. Right. I think we're almost done now. Let me just 
save before I continue. I think we don't need the light bridge... anymore. We can put this cube here. Doesn't really matter which cube, I don't think. I'm still concerned about that, because I don't know what that was for. We haven't used it yet. I mean, I've technically used it a bunch, but... So far, for the puzzles that we've done, we haven't actually used it. Maybe we will find out. Maybe I just need to stand on it. That's probably it. There we go. Ah, fell off. <laughs> Here, what all can I see? I think I know what I have to do. How am I gonna time this correctly, though? Because I can't really see very well. Yeah, I was a little bit late on that. So close! Come on! So close. A little bit longer than that, it would seem. Yes! Did it! Excellent. Now I just do that. Ta-da! Excellent puzzle. A little bit execution-based, but otherwise I like it. Well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!